Hey guys, Zed Raised here, bringing you sniping in a story. I think this is episode 22, and like that's just a crazy number. But I decided to go back to Marvel for free because I've not played it in a while, and then everyone seemed to be playing it. So I was like, yep, I'll play it. And before I start this, guys, I don't think I've ever found sniping this hard in my whole life. I actually go over a really good score, uh, you'll see at the end uh, my score. Uh, but I was quite surprised at the score because I was trying pretty much like. It was last week, I was trying so much to get a score, like a good score in this, so I could bring you more for free. Uh, and it just took me forever. But I'm going to go into the story, and the story is when I went away. It's actually two weeks ago because I didn't bring out Snape in the story last week. But I went away for two weeks to, like, it was a place, and they were away from me. It's like this little village. Uh, my nana lives there, it's called like, Goylehead, if you don't know. Uh, well, m m maybe uh, one person knows, uh, everyone who watches my videos, one person will know where like, Goylehead is. But it's this little town, uh, uh, sorry, a village. And it's like just it's a really nice place to really like get like going there just to get away and it's just completely different uh, to the town I live in. So I went there on the Wednesday and came back on the Saturday, but quite a few things happened, quite a few funny things happened. I'm gonna mention the probably the funniest thing ever. Uh, I have a friend called Declan, if you don't know he's six foot eight and he's scared of open water, right? Because he thinks a basking shark's gonna get him. But it was just funny, and then we went in the water. I was in the water, and then he was like, right, "Kill, join you." So we were in the water for a while, and then my uncle was there, and then he threw a frisbee. And he threw a frisbee so we could catch it in the water. And actually, as the deck there's a frisbee, he turned round and the frisbee hit him straight in the nose. And I was like, I was just start laughing in that, and then I turned, well, I turned away and was like laughing, and then I turned back to him, and all you see was just blood, just dripping from his face. And I was like, okay. And then I was like, this is really, really thing. So he panicked and like ran out, just ran like straight out. And I was like, I don't blame him for running out because like, drop it, like, obviously he's bleeding, but if he's scared of sharks and he thinks there's sharks in the lock, then why wouldn't you run away? Because you're bleeding. I mean, that was probably the funniest thing. And then I got hit again with a frisbee uh, by my uncle. I was running to get a football and he threw the frisbee at me. So unfortunately we didn't get him back, but if uh, we go up again, I'm definitely going to try and, me and Decker are going to try and get him back. Uh, but we were up, well, well, we're up there, we went fishing a few times and then Deck keeps on going on about the time he caught 150 fish. And I was like, okay, Declan, he keeps on saying this 150 fish, 150 fish. And I was like, no way. So we went out there and obviously he didn't catch 150 fish. I think he caught, I think he got two, my uncle caught two and I caught one. But he caught one and then we went in for dinner and then my uncle Stephen went out before us. And I was like, okay, I need to catch one. Like, I need, I think this was the Friday actually, or the Thursday. I was like, I need to catch one, I need to catch one. Really just want to, like, so I don't feel bad. So I don't feel like I've failed and then, like, I feel bad about myself. I feel bad for myself. So I was like, I definitely want to catch one. And I caught one. I was like, yes. And then Deck caught one. And I was like, okay, that's fair. Uh, but guys, I would just like to fill you in, like what I do when I'm not actually recording and what I, what I kind of got up to in life. But so it was good to get away. Hopefully, uh, on Tuesday I'm going up to visit my sister and the nearest the nearest city. Uh, that is Glasgow. It's like it should be the capital of Scotland, but it's not. But it is one of the biggest. Um, cities and I think there's only two cities in Scotland. I really don't know. No, there's more. There's a lot more. I was just I just thought of Edinburgh, and Glasgow. And that's the only cities I could really think of. But I know there's like more. Uh, so yeah, guys. So hopefully going there on Tuesday. Uh, I need to get some shopping done for college. So that should be fun. I might Instagram a few pictures. If you want to know what my Instagram is, then it's in the description below. But this guy, this is the guy with the tack, and he keeps on spawning on that tack, and I didn't realize it first. And I was like, okay. He's not spawning, and then he keeps on spawning up there to cheat. And I was like, why cheat? And I was just, I found it so hard to snipe in this, guys. And I was just, I really wanted to bring you a good gameplay. And in my opinion, this is pretty decent gameplay. And then, I can't believe I didn't get him. He knifed me. What? So I was like, really disappointed by this. Uh, I'm trying to think what else happened up at Manana's. We had really good, like, food because uh, Manana's a really good cook. But that's, that's pretty much what we did. Uh, deck. Deck played Assassin's Creed, I think he was playing, is it Revolutions maybe? Yeah, I think he was playing that, he played that like the whole time and nearly completed the whole thing. I was like, that's impressive. So I found that, I found it fun and it's always good to get away guys. If you ever feel, I'm not saying sad or anything, but if you're ever kind of bored and you're kind of sitting there and you don't really have anything to do and you either just go on Xbox for the sake of it. And this guy keeps on spawning on his tack and I was like, that's it, I'm just going to destroy it because it was just in my head then. I was like, I just try to kill him before he put his tack down and I was just, it was just taking rips, so I just sentexed it and destroyed him and destroyed him and attack. 
Uh, so that's pretty much it. But yeah, guys, if like I was saying, if you ever want to get away, then just you should just get away for a few days because it's always nice to like get away, clear your head. Especially if I was visiting family, and since I started YouTube, I don't really, I've not really been away because I need to kind of put out. Well, I don't need to put out videos, but I want to put out videos to try and keep this up, keep committed. So it's hard to plan out videos for like a whole week. And like it's just hard, so I had to upload everything pre, like upload everything, and then when it came to, it, I just had to make it public. So I'm finding a lot more easier ways to record. And as you can see, guys, there's no audio to this. Like there's no game audio, unfortunately, because Sony Vegas was giving me a nightmare. Like I made a video about, uh, but now it's all sorted. I find a, a lot faster way of recording. Well, not recording, but like rendering my videos and kind of getting a better quality of my videos. So. Hopefully you guys will notice that soon about how good my quality is getting. But this is kind of coming to a wrap. But I want to thank you guys for the, the support you've showed on this like this um, series, that like Sniping a Story, because it means so much to me. And you guys don't understand the commitment you've kept up and just genuine fans. That's all I'm saying, it's just genuine fans. But this is coming to a wrap. So if you ever want to ask me anything, my link to my Twitter is down below. And if you could, could you like my Facebook fan page because it does help me out and it does get me noticed more. But as always guys, have a nice day, thanks for watching, I'm Zed Raised, bye.